Welcome to Web Handling. My name is Dave Roysom. I am very excited to begin a short series on curl. In this first clip, we define curl by appearance. In subsequent clips, we will go beyond appearance to the distinctly different mechanics that can cause curl and what those mechanics suggest for remedy. Recall from our Web 101 class that a wrinkle is when the web is not dead flat. Recall from our Web 101 class that curl is one of the half dozen major types of wrinkling. The free Wrinkle Troubleshooter by Abbott App is a convenient way to recall the essentials of this class material. The most common direction of curl is in the CD or cross direction. By direction, I mean the axis about which the web curves. We could use the same right-hand rule that we learned in math and engineering. The fingers curve in the direction of the curvature, and the thumb labels the axis. We can have positive and negative curl, or up curl and down curl in plant parlance. The first point of confusion and there are many with the subject curl, is nomenclature for direction. The CD label we give here is what scientists and engineers would call it. Unfortunately, most plants call this MD curl. This means that clear pictograms are needed for any supplier or customer that has curled web. In any case, the mechanics are caused by residual MD stresses such that the top is shorter than the bottom or vice versa. We can also have curl in the other direction as well. This is called MD curl by scientists and CD curl by the plants. In any case, whatever you call it, the top of the web wants to be narrower than the bottom or vice versa. Whenever you have the first curl direction, you also tend to have curl in the other direction to a smaller degree. Finally, there is chiral curl. This is a curvature on the diagonal or angle. This is sometimes called corner curl. It is most common with anisotropic materials where the principal axis of the top and bottom are not aligned. The next point of confusion is that the curl mechanism can appear quite different with certain products. The most common appearance is the conventional form where the web wants to roll into a tube such as a roll of photographic film, a roll of stamps, or a coil of sheet metal would tend to do. These everyday examples are curvature about the wound roll axis and are a specific mechanics called roll set curl. There is, of course, the possibility of curl in the other direction. There is, of course, different ways of making curl that we will get to in subsequent clips. However, what a lot of laminators do not understand is that their tunnel wrinkles are curl with one tiny wrinkle added. Excuse the pun. That is, curl plus delamination makes a transverse wrinkle across the width. We know that these TD wrinkles are equivalent because you can in some cases see conventional curl morph into tunnel wrinkles with lesser curl right in front of your eyes. Specifically, these cases are with low tack adhesives when the tail is cut or unwrapped from the wound roll. Also along these same lines, coating people do not often understand that cracked coatings are the same as curl with one tiny difference. That is, tensions in the coating cause the coating to crack instead of pull the web into curvature. In all of these cases, the blue wants to be longer or wider than the red bottom. The only difference is whether the adhesive or coating gives way in the process. 
Thank you so very much for watching this module in my plant practical video series. Stay tuned for the next clip where we talk about quantifying the severity of curl by measurement.